Hey there, welcome to The Junk Drawer. My name is Enzo, and today we are talking about the Ken and Barbie base dolls from the Barbie movie. So right off the bat, I want to apologize for the noise in the background. I do have my AC running because it's really hot. So um, that on top of the regular noise that comes from my outside. Uh, so I just wanted to put that out there up front. But anyway, uh, I am very excited because I just received the Ken and Barbie uh, dolls from the movie. I believe these are called the Perfect Day uh, dolls. These are the least expensive dolls. These are $25 a piece. Uh, Mattel just released a whole bunch of new dolls from the line that are $50, so a little more expensive. So these are kind of the baseline dolls. So uh, I'm, I am super excited to get into these. So let's take a look at the boxes real quick. So this is the Barbie box. And I love the, the Barbie logo. I love the shininess of it. And on the back, uh, we have a picture of Margot Robbie as Barbie. And then on the sides, it's this cute little, you know, cute pink uh, Barbie logo with some photos, blah, blah, blah. So <laughs> that's, that's the box. And then the Ken box. So here's the front of the Ken box. And then the sides are the same. But the back has a picture of the dream house instead of a shot of Barbie. So there are the boxes. So let me get these out of the boxes and we can take a closer look. Okay, so they are out of the box. So yeah, let's start with Barbie first. So here is her front. And then her back. Uh, so yeah, she's overall first impressions. Uh, she's she's cute. She's very cute. I can I can see the Margot Robbie uh, face a little better in person. Um, still not convinced that it looks like her really, but uh, they did they did what they could. Uh, mine actually has a little scuff on on her nose. I don't know if you can see that, but there's a little black scuff. Uh, I'm not sure what that's about, but anyway. Uh, her hair feels nice. I'm not sure if it's Polly or, or um, Saran, but it does feel okay. It doesn't feel awful. Um, she's got this like cute little bow in her hair. She's got these uh, white dangly earrings, this necklace. Um, she's wearing this cute little plaid gingham dress. Uh, she does have underwear, which is kind of interesting. And then her shoes, her one shoe keeps falling off because it is not attached. Um, but yeah, they're just basic. Come on. Her shoes keep falling off. Um, but yeah, her shoes are very basic. They're just like these, these cute little pumps with this little heart on the top there. Yeah, she's cute. The bangs are super stiff. <laughs> um, and I know there's a there's a thing where that she doesn't have the movie accurate bangs. Her bangs in the movie are more curtain bangs, but these are more like straight across. So people are, are annoyed about that, but it's, it's an easy fix if you wanna fix it. Um, and as far as articulation goes, she has side to side and then shoulder, elbow, wrist. She's got basic articulation, not made to move, but very basic. Uh, her leg can go up and she can bend her knee. There's nothing at her foot. Uh, also, she's got uh, pointed toes, so yeah. So before we get into Ken, he does come with an accessory, which I don't know why. Um, I mean, I guess I know why, but this is a very strange, accessory it's a it's a like a surfboard and he, his feet like clip into there into the little little, little clips there uh there's like no branding on it it's, it's very it's it looks very cheap and it kind of is cheap it's just like this like plastic uh material so i could do without this uh, personally, I could do with like an accessory for him or something else instead of that, but what are you gonna do? So here is Ken. 
Um, the first thing I notice is that he does have rooted hair, which is which is nice, I guess. Um, he does not look like Ryan Gosling at all. I'm not sure if they were even trying to make him look like Ryan Gosling, but there's zero re resemblance there. Uh, am I am I like missing it? I don't know. But um, yeah, so here's his front and then his back. So yeah, he's he's got a simple uh, shirt on. It's like a short sleeve uh, button up. I do love that he was posed with his hand in his pocket in the box. That's really cute. And then he's got these shorts on that match his shirt, which is also adorable. And then he's got his little white white sneakers on. So very cute. And then articulation is the same. It's basic articulation. So side to side, shoulder, elbow, wrist, and then knee and nothing at the foot. So I'm glad whenever uh, Barbie comes out with new Kens, just in general. Um, but yeah, I don't know. I'm 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 happy with this. I think it's a, I love the outfit. The outfit is really cute, and um, the doll itself, the face, the face sculpt is 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 cute. I can't tell if it's what they've been using recently, if it's the same one. But again, it is gelled uh very much it's he's got helmet head for sure so yeah i'm not sure if i'm gonna wash him out or not i feel like anytime i attempt to wash out gel from a doll's head it it doesn't turn out well so we'll see we'll, we'll see if I'm, I'm feeling uh daring but but yeah that's that's ken so here's a cute couple together um yeah they're they're super cute so would I recommend you buy these? Sure. <laughs> um, I think they are very cute dolls. Uh, of course, I'm more excited about the Ken just because I'm more of a boy doll collector, but the Margot Robbie doll is, is cute. And I actually ordered a few, did I order? No, <laughs> I lied. <laughs> Um, I actually ordered a few more of the Kens, so those should be coming at some point, and I'll be putting reviews up for those. I would love to know what you think about these uh, base dolls for the Barbie movie. Do you feel like the Barbie looks like Margot Robbie or the Ken looks like Ryan Gosling at all? Uh, I, I, it's so weird. Um, yeah, let me know in the comments below. I would love to hear what you think. So thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. If you haven't already, please remember to subscribe to the channel and I will catch you next time.